Hey folks, welcome back to Stuff I Kinda Care About. I'm Danny, and today I am here with Josh. Hi. Um, so we've got some wood in the back of his truck, and we've got the miter saw set up there with some saw horses, and we're going to be doing a project for uh, the deck at Tubbs Shrimp and Fish Company here in Florence. They want a couple of standing bars built out on the deck so we're going to cut up some wood and drill some holes and screw some screws and do all the weird woodworking stuff the and work. yeah I mean just have fun um, basically it's just kind of an excuse for the two of us to hang out on a Sunday morning when it's like what is it like 55 degrees it's cold it's freaking gorgeous Beautiful. I love it came out of my sweatshirt it was warm enough I know just moving around so we're going to have some fun. We're going to get moving on this. I'm going to do camera off, Today, camera on. Today's November 10th. Happy Marine Corps birthday. Ooh. Yes. Happy Marine Corps birthday. Um, so we're going to do some of this stuff. Just keep it weird. Have some fun. Oh, we get to do it weird. Oh, wait, I know. Normal. Yeah. <laughs> that's what we always do. Um, hopefully this turns out all right. I'm going to turn the camera off and we're going to do some stuff and I'll turn it back on and yell at you some more. And but don't come out right, it's my fault. Yeah, we're, we're both going to share the blame on this because it's, <laughs> it's probably going to get a little weird. So, thanks for watching and uh, I'll check in with you in a little bit. Sure. Alright. He's filming. Wood. He's filming wood? Miter saw. Who talks like that? He's filming wood. Dude. It's not even complete sentences. Talk to Don't hey, even everybody. start with me. We're making wood stuff. Is this your channel? It, it could be. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we've taken these pieces. Uh, we took a, a flap wheel on an angle grinder, rounded these ends down. There, you can see. Um, rounded the corners off. These are actually going to be standing bars. So we don't want anybody to catch hips or, you know, rib meat on them. Uh, we also took these delightful 4 uh rounded these corners down, cut them to 42 inches. So the whole thing's going to stand at about 44 inches. We got a little bit more work we're going to throw into these, and you're going to get to watch them come together. So he's going to make fun of me more, and I'm probably going to make fun of him some more. I love you. And I love you too. And we're going to keep doing this thing. If I can figure out lighting and stop talking where the light's at my back and I'm in complete shadow. So, oh look, he's behind me. Hmm. <laughs> I'll catch you guys in a minute. Um, used a T30 to put it in and got it at 45 degrees, plumbing. He's doing my, he's doing my hand, look at him. He's, he's YouTubing me, YouTubing him. So anyway, we did the 45 degree angle, got everything perfect. Went ahead and put this in place. We have a support here so that we add a little, little bit of extra structural support holding these in place. The idea is we want to get all this flush and level and at a 45 degree angle. These are our tops that are going to go on here. This is ready except for we got to put our brackets. This is going to be our 45 degree angle bracket that's going to go into the metal like this basically. So Again, this is in here in the wood also to give it a little extra structural support. We've got to go, we've got to put this on top, we got to put this on here, and then we're going to put this at tubs. All right, so this nerd's getting some video. Um, we've got some tops right here. These are going to get a little bit more just sanding casual sanding trying to clean things up a little bit right now we've got this super awesome these are the bodies so this is actually kind of how they're going to be sitting this is the whole frame so they're going to be against uh eight inch steel beams and so we've got the brackets for that um these are actually coming together very nicely i'm pretty excited how do you feel about this we're good. I'm, I'm happy. Uh, I'm really tickled at the 45 degree angles and the 90 degree angles coming out perfect and plumb. Uh, and I think it's very secure. Uh, I want to put these on there so that, that part's done with. I, I want to be able to 
take this up there with it somewhat done um, to the point that we can just drill into the metal and, and, and attach it and be done. Um, yeah, basically just do like a really quick wham bam install. This is sturdy. It's uh, well put together. It's not going anywhere anytime. Uh, I think we're all right. I think we're, I think we're fantastic. Yeah, I mean, I'm not mad about it, so. Yep. I think it's going to look really sexy once it's installed. Yep. All right, well, I'm going to turn the camera off. Say bye to the beautiful people. Bye, beautiful people. Later, nerds. All right, so we've got one loaded into the bed of the truck. we still got one standing here so you can actually see what it looks like and it is looking good I'm really happy with these so we're gonna end up attaching a metal bracket under the bottom here and that's gonna get attached to the steel pole on site but these are looking very good the other thing we're gonna have to do is come back in and hit these with a little bit more wood filler just to make sure everything's clean but they're looking good how you feeling about this i'm excited yeah yeah it's turned out beautiful i'm pretty proud of these speaking of beautiful these chairs man oh those are gorgeous these are sold if anybody wants some cedar chairs uh let danny know and he'll get in touch with me yeah, I'll, I'm also going to leave uh, links to all of my and Josh's uh, stuff down in the description. I have a so, podcast, Stuff I Heard podcast. Also, you can find me on YouTube, Joshua Peak. Yeah. E -E -E -K. So, all those links are going to be down in the description. That way you guys can jump over to his channel, see some of the stuff that he shot from today, and check out some of his other videos, because he's doing some really cool stuff. So, I'm going to leave us here. Next time you see us, we are going to be on site getting these things installed. Okay, so we're on site. And this is where these little bars are going to go. I got that one kicked up at the end just to make sure it's staying in place. So, basically what we have to do is we're going to take these brackets gonna pop them right in that joint right there so we're gonna have to drill through that steel and all that fun stuff but this install should only take a few minutes and I will let you guys know what it looks like when we are on the next step all right so we're running into some uh, super awesome problems with getting these holes drilled because the steel is really thick and really terrible Bits. Yeah, it's absolutely eating drill bits alive. Which, you know, I should have seen coming. But I didn't. Because I'm an idiot. So, we're going to take a second and calm down and try to reevaluate the situation and see where we go from here. So, stay tuned for more chicanery.